If your gas dryer is not heating or heating intermittently, the gas valve coils could be defective. You can test each coil using an ohm meter to determine if the coils have continuity, a continuous electrical path present in the coil. You can choose from a variety of multimeters to perform the test. For this demonstration, we will use both analog and digital models. When using an analog model, first rotate the range selection dial to the setting for 1K or 1000 ohms of resistance. Then calibrate the meter by pinching the probes together while adjusting the needle to read zero. When using a digital model, rotate the dial to the setting for 2000 ohms of resistance. Before testing the gas valve coils, we recommend removing them from the appliance. When testing a two-terminal coil, use a probe to touch one of the coil's terminals and the second probe to touch the other terminal. The coil should indicate a resistance between 1000 and 2000 ohms. When testing a three-terminal coil, touch one probe to terminal one, which is the common terminal, and touch the other probe to the second terminal. The coil should indicate a resistance between 300 and 2000 ohms. Now keeping the probe on the common terminal, move the other probe to the third terminal. Again, the coil should indicate a resistance between 300 and 2000 ohms. You may need to experiment with the resistance settings to detect continuity, but even then the test can be inconclusive. If, at any time during the drying process, you observe the igniter glowing and then shutting off without establishing a flame, then one or more of the gas valve coils have probably failed. If you have replaced the coils and the igniter continues to glow and shut off without establishing a flame, then it's likely that the gas valve itself is defective and will need to be replaced. <laughs>